שלום, קל הלל יהווה, בהשם יהווה שי, בהשם רכה הקודש. Double honor to the elder apostles of the great millstone, GMS. Peace, blessings and salutations to the elect. Abba Rathaza, which means Father Willing. So Father Willing, this lesson is uh, edifying. Wow. This is six, six, sick. <laughs> All right. This is absolutely six, six, sick. Right here, man. But it's the typical nature of E. All right. It's right up there, Ali. It's their natural behavior. This is why E needs to be subjected. Okay. Because they want to perpetuate this type of madness all over the planet. So, here's an article from the Yorkshire Post.co.uk. And it's, you know, fairly recent. It's published on the 30th of November 2024. All right, and I've got two other articles as well. And uh, you can see the headline. Obviously, Satan's darked, darkened the thing. All right. It says, Sheffield woman has admitted that she had sex with her dog multiple times. Disgusting man. A Sheffield woman faced a jail after pleading guilty to having sex with a dog. Paige Reaney, 32 years of age, admitting having intercourse with the pug, named Charlie, on four separate occasions. She denied possessing extreme pornographic images of open quote intercourse or oral sex with an animal, end quote, during a brief hearing at Sheffield Crown Court on Thursday. Yeah, these are the people that run the world, yeah? Beginning with the elites. It says, the incidents span between August 2019 and December 2022, the court was told. Okay, that's the individual right there. She looks more than 33. <laughs> Her partner, Graham Marshall, 38, previously admitted helping. <laughs> it really is a laughing matter, man. But, yeah... Two of them, man. Low lives. Her partner, Graham Marshall, 38, previously admitting helping Reenie have sex with a dog. And I bet he do not look his age either. An earlier hearing heard how he and Reenie caused unnecessary suffering to a mutt called Charlie by, open quote, regularly subjecting him to habitual sexual activity, end quote. And in October, Marshall pleaded guilty to one count of aiding and abetting a female person to have sexual intercourse with a dog. He also pleaded guilty to one offence of causing unnecessary suffering to a protected animal, namely regularly subjecting him to habitual sexual activity, including, open quote, inappropriate, inappropriate physical handling of the dog, end quote. And that's him too. This is just, this, nah man. Ah. Moral deck, this is sad. This is the this, speak and he admitted another offense of failing to ensure the wealth the welfare of the dog in that he failed to protect him from pain and suffering caused by habitual sexual activity marshall also pleaded guilty to one count of voyeurism and three counts of possessing extreme pornographic images related to sexual acts involving a dead slash alive animal he further admitted seven counts of making indecent photographs of pseudo photographs of children of categories a b and c Sick, twisted and demented. But Marshall pleaded not guilty to one count of making indecent photographs of children of category C. Category A is the most serious. He is set to come back before the court on December 12th for a further hearing. Rene of Sheffield faces up to two years in prison for the offence. Look at all these things these guys are, are doing. Oh dear. So you got bestiality. Okay. Indecent photographs of children. Oh, that's just oh. Oh no no no. Oh dear. That is flipping filthy. Makes you sick. This man makes you sick straight away. You see. <laughs> makes you absolutely you know man. You see, the Prophet Job spoke, right, and described their despicable behaviour. 
perfectly okay This needs to be exposed, man. Let's go to the book of Job, yeah? Chapter 30, verse 1. Okay. And it reads, But now they that are younger than I have me in derision, whose fathers I would have disdained to have set with the dogs of my flock. You can't keep these people around animals, man. Especially, you know, your, your pets and that. Because this is the type of stuff to do. Just like we saw in the article. Okay. Okay. And the word younger, you know, in this uh, context means insignificant. Alright. Let's go to the Strong's H6810 concordance number. Okay. Taza Aya. Little insignificant, young, insignificant me, young, younger, youngest, little insignificant, right? Something that's insignificant is not re is not really important, okay? You see, at one at one point, these devils were in the caves, man, grunting, right, on all fours. That's how they get around, picking lice out of the hair, eating it, wearing the same clothes until it disintegrated on on themselves. Beastly behavior. Okay, you see, they won't tell you this part of history, right? In their schools, will they? Right? You devils have to be civilized. Okay? That's what they were doing in the caves of Georgia, Russia. Right? Cave dwellers. Alright? That's where you get the word, you know, Caucasian from. Alright? Again, because of their behavior, man, you can't trust them around your pets. You can't trust them around animals. Okay, they get down with the dogs, man. Okay. Kissing it on the mouth, all sorts. Oh. See, if we were living in a righteous world where the laws, statutes and, command and commandments of the Holy Bible was implemented and it was the government standard, right? They would not be incarcerated, man. Instead, they would be put down permanently, right? Just like when you put down a dog when, you know... It's in excruciating pain or, you know, it's attacked and possibly deleted someone. You know, they, they have the veterinary and put that dog down. Right? In this case, these two weirdos would be put down, terminated. All right? Why? Why would you, like, get turned on by a dog, honestly? Honestly, I don't get it. Let's skip the law. Let's go to the book of Leviticus. See, who can make straight what the Lord has made crooked? These devils are always going to do some filthy, disgusting, nasty things. Leviticus chapter 20, verses 15 to 16. We'll get it in the Amplified Bible translation. Right, and it reads, If a man has intimate relations with an animal, he shall most, he shall most certainly be put to death. You shall kill the animal also. Right, it's part of the law. See, so both the that individual and the animal must be put to death. Verse sixteen, in the AMP. If a woman approaches any animal to mate with it, you shall kill the woman and the animal. They shall most certainly be put to death. Their blood is on them. Again, again, it's all part of the law. All right, it's very disgraceful. Right. You have to you have to be a wrong un, all right? Someone with mental disorders to, to violate an animal like that. But you see, that's something that they see is our right to do. Okay? They don't feel no way about it. You see? That doesn't come in like nothing to them. It's like an everyday thing. <laughs> you see? Job chapter 30. Go to verse 5. They were driven from among men. They cried after them as after a thief. To dwell in the cliffs of the valleys in caves of the earth and in the rocks. Right, that's their natural, you know, habitat. You know, to dwell in caves and rocks. Alright, they like that. Okay. Mount Seir, you know, was their original inhabitant land. 
okay, living in those holes in, in the mountains. Then eventually they migrated, you know, north into, you know, Poland and, and Georgia, Russia, right? And they lived in the in the caves, all right? Caves in the mountains, all right? Verse 7, among the bushes they braided under the nettles that were gathered together. They were children of fools, yea, children of base men. They were viler than the earth, base, bottom, low, okay? And that, that's wild behavior, man, okay? Again, these are the people... <laughs> These are the people running the world. These are the people you 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 have to go and get in, an interview with and shake their hands and you know and you might even send your your children to school with these people, right? Go to college with them, all right? Live next door to them on the street that you have to interact with every day. Honestly, all right. E is definitely based. This is a based. Oh, this is the basis of men right here, all right? Psalm chapter 12 verse 8, the wicked walk on every side when the vilest men are exalted. Okay. That's what... You see, that's why this contemptible behaviour is normalised in the society because they dictate what is normal and what isn't. Okay, they dictate what is legal and what isn't. All right. Hebrews chapter 12, verse 16 reads, Lest there be any fornicator or profane person, as these are profane meaning outside the temple, all right, who for one morsel of meat sold his birthright. For you know how that afterward, when he would have inherited the blessing, he was rejected, for he found no place of repentance, though he sought it carefully with tears. You see? See, he needs to be under subjection. You are the nations too, right? Because you'd be doing some, you know, weird, freaky, deaky stuff. All right? That is devil, of course. You know, he... The things he does, oh, because he's the wicked. All right? But, you, of course, all you heathens need to be subjected. Okay? See, the earth is out of course. All right? That's some freaky, deaky stuff going on. All right? You want to tell me not one out of those two ever considered what they were doing? Not one could say to the other, no, don't, no, this is, out, this is off limits, this is out of bounds, this ain't right, don't do this, okay? Not, not one of it, not one of those could say, those, could say that, I think it. <laughs> They're proud of it too, man. Proud of it. Proverbs chapter 12 and verse 10. A righteous man regardeth the life of his beast, but the tender mercies of the wicked are cruel. Yeah. Tender mercies of the wicked are cruel, man. And that's them. Cruel to the animal. Alright? That's animal abuse right here. You see? They're quick to, you know, to lock you up for, you know, for animal abuse, harming animals, you know, in the UK. Alright? But look at the punishment that these two get. Corrupted the creature. Quick to call like RSPCA on you, and then look, look what these two do. All right. See now that animal has to be put down. Okay. See, it was already confirmed in the spirit. Okay, that these devils would be rejected anyway. Okay, so it doesn't matter how many tears you know he can shed. Right. You know Isaac still blessed him anyway, right with the sword. Okay, and his whole existence is to get venge, right vengeance. Okay, upon us, Jacob. All right. Hey, look what they, they they don't feel any any way about this whatsoever, man. It's what they you know did to this dog. Man, I ain't the only animal they do things to either. Okay. You see. Here's an update on that article, alright? This is from the star.co.uk, this was put out on the 12th, alright, 12th of December this year, 
Graham Marshall paid Rini new court date set in Sheffield dog sex case after hearing it's pushed back. So yeah, Paige Rini, age 33, pleaded guilty to having intercourse with the dog and to a second charge specifying four occasions of intercourse at Sheffield Crown Court, November the 28th, 2024. During the, the course of the same hearing, she denied one count of possession of extreme pornography images of intercourse or oral sex with the animal. Look at that, man. A new date of Thursday, December the 19th, right, it's a few days from now, for the mentioned hearing has now been fixed and Rena will also be, will not be required to attend them at hearing. Again, these push, we should be put down, man, not have this push back. But, you know, we're in, we're living under, you know, these devil's, you know, rules and regulations in his kingdom. All right. So wickedness is, it abounds, man. All right. Here's another article. This is from the, the Scottish Sun. Okay. <coughs> Sick beyond belief. Put out on the 5th of December. Cops probe disgusting footage showing Scotswoman having intercourse with XL Bully Dog. Videos and images circulating on social media reported to the force by sickened members of the public shocked by the cruel and disturbing, disturbing animal abuse. Yeah, we're not shocked because we know that's their typical behaviour. It's understood, the, it's understood the woman in the clip carrying out the vile acts on the pet dog on a paid for webcam channel is from Belshill near Glasgow and has links to East Kilbride. Alright. There are thought to be at least be 10 videos recorded and shared online by the woman. Oh. One of the extreme bestiality videos seen by the Scottish Sun has been since posted on an adult website and messenger platform Telegram. Oh, yeah, that's enough of that, man. So I'm going to leave it there. Shallow one.